Okay, for this scene, we gotta focus on emotion, on motivation. Melissa, you look great. Thank you. Yeah, but you don't feel great, okay? I don't? No, 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 you're, you're Rita, and Rita's tormented. You know? Tormented? Yeah. Brendan, how do I look? You look uh, forlorn, Jason. Do I look great? No, no, you, you look forlorn. I don't feel forlorn. Jason, you're playing the part of Randy, and Randy is forlorn. Brendan. Yeah? Um, is this forlorn? Uh, no, actually, no. Forlorn. How about this? <laughs> forlorn is sad, Jason. You, you got it. How about this? Ruff! <laughs> Ruff! Ruff! Melissa. Yeah? How do you spell sophisticated? Um, <clears throat> okay, sophisticated. S O. Wait, 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 wait. Whoa, 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 whoa. Slow down. Take it one letter at a time. As you were saying. Sophisticated. S O. Right. You know what? What? You don't have to do that spelling bee crap. It's just the way that I know how to spell but it. But in just... reality, you don't have to say words before you say them. But I like, know. I don't have to say, say, every, every word, word, twice, twice. All right? All right? Okay. You did S -O it again, Melissa. I'm sorry. Just spell the word. Um, I can't do it without saying it. Come on. S-O-F. All right, S-O-F. I-S-T-I. T E. Right. Sophisticated. D. C. Oh, I thought it was over. D. C. D. And then another D at the end. Two Ds at the end? Does it look right with two Ds? No. One D. You have an eraser? Yeah. Well, give it to me. The eraser smells like strawberries. Well, it doesn't taste like strawberries. C. D. Wow. That's a long word. I know. Do me a favor, will you? Mm-hmm. You read this and tell me what you think. What is it? That's a paper I wrote, not an article. Wow. Yeah. I write for a newspaper occasionally. That's impressive. Yeah. Well, just read it, please. Okay. Handsome, sophist, so handsome. Sophisticated, Melissa. Oh, right. <laughs> handsome, sophisticated man enjoys fine wine and lots of it. <laughs> yeah, I love that. Seeks beautiful woman for long walks. That's really sweet, Coach McGurk. I changed it from enjoys alcohol. It sounds nicer. I mean, I have to boil down my whole personality in one huge lie. You did a good job. Well, thanks. Jason, stop picking your nose. Melissa, I'm not picking it. I'm pulling things out of it. We're, uh, we're set for Saturday, right? Hi, Brendan. Hi, Jason. We're set for Saturday, guys? Saturday? Yeah. Um, stop picking your nose. No, because the, the... All right, guys, so we're on for Saturday? Brenda, I think I'm available maybe even mm. next Saturday. Okay, you know, I'm only actually interested in uh, this... Actually, uh, Brendan, I can't make it. Well, what, do you, what do you mean uh, you can't make it? Well, I'm going to visit my grandfather in the nursing home. Do you have to go? No, but I like visiting him. I mean, he's really old, but he's really nice. For your own sake, do not go, because, you know, it's not healthy for you to be hanging around with old people because, you know, you could catch an old person's disease and uh, suddenly become old. Brendan, that's a myth. You'd like my grandfather. He's a great storyteller. Mm, you know Titanic? Right. Yeah, of course I do. He saw the original movie. <laughs> well, that's a... Uh, <laughs> my, uh, my, Brendan, my grandfather calls me Debbie and tries to kiss me. No. My grandfather was um, a surgeon and lost a big malpractice suit because he cut off the wrong leg. That's awful. It's it's terrible, Jason. Yeah, you know, that's what the patient said, but he was a little more angry. Is your grandfather still a surgeon? No, that's the short story. The long story is now he's a very successful uh, malpractice lawyer. I'll get it! I'll get it! Small residence. Brandon? Uh, who's calling, please? It's me. Hey. Hey. Kevin? No, it's Melissa. Oh. What are you doing? I'm talking to you. I have an idea. Mm -hmm. Actually, a proposition. I'm listening. Do you want to do a documentary about my grandfather? I'm, uh, I'm not listening. No, I don't. Why? Uh, Melissa, I don't do documentaries. How come? Because I don't. Oh, I see. You don't do them because they're too hard. What? No, no. Oh, maybe because... A documentary is not like a regular movie. Melissa, I know the difference between a documentary and a regular movie, okay? So Yeah? Yeah, I do, and I have the versatility to do both. In yeah? Case you're, yeah? Yeah, and uh, I will do your documentary of your grandfather. I will, because as a director, I don't want to be pigeon-toed, all right? You mean pigeonholed? Yes. So you'll do it? Yeah, of, of course I will. Okay, good, because here's the best part. My father said that he'll pay you because he wants to show the video at my grandfather's 75th birthday party next week. Pay? As in money? Mm-hmm. For doing what I love to do? Yep. Throw, throw a number out, you know. Ten? That sounds great. Okay. All right.
I gotta go. I already hung up. Oh, Brendan? Boo, boo, boo. We're sorry. The call you... Brendan, that's enough of the song. Mom, Please. Hey, I'm being creative. Look Lights at this guy. Red. It's a car, not a couch. Oh, so... Come on, you old fart. <laughs> oh, Mom. Yeah. Come on, Gramps. Let's go. Move it. Yeah, old people. He's sitting there. <laughs> yeah. He's sleeping. sleeping. Move it. Move it. Thank you. Thank you. Ah! <laughs> oh, Mom. We have so much fun on our car rides, don't we? Mom. 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 Hey, is this Mozart? I think the Valdi. No, no, behind you. <laughs> Dad, not too much butter. You gotta watch your cholesterol. You're absolutely right. You have it. So, Dad, how was your day? I didn't tell you. I, I, I sold two houses. That's great. Yeah, one of them was for sale. Dad. How was school? I got a star in my paper. Well, you can get it off. Don't worry about that. <laughs> No, that, that's good. Did, did you sell a house? No. Loser. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but I am so proud of you, Melissa. You know that, don't you? Yes. Hey, I'm excited about this video recording project. Grandpa is really... He's going to love it. Or hate it. He's going to react. Two kids cheeseburgers two kids and one cheeseburgers. adult. Two small fries. Yes. Two small fries. Okay. No, forget the small fries. Forget Just mom, one large. No. Two small orange sodas. Mom, mom, I want my own fries. No, we're going to no, split it. mom. Two small orange sodas and a Just large... Mom, I want my own. You never finish your own fries. It's a waste of food and money. No, you, but, no but someday I'm going to finish them, Mom, and today could be that day. You know, Don't you feel it, Mom? Come on. Come on. Yeah, Mom. See, Mom, even the speaker guy says I should have my own fries, and he does this for a living. It's true. No. Mommy, he deals with fries all day. He knows. No. Mom, he knows fries. How about I handle my kids, okay, mister? Just try to help. Do you have any money on you? No. Okay, look, you distract the waiter. I'm going to slip out the back and start the car, okay? Dad. Okay, you distract the waiter, I'll start the car. Dad. Okay, you know what? Forget the car. Let's just both distract the waiter. <laughs> How's your cheeseburger, Brendan? Is that what this is supposed to be? Funny, how are those fries coming? Um, I don't know what you're talking I, about. I think I still see some fries there. Well, I, I um, can't uh, finish them. Thank you for asking. Why can't you because finish Because there the are too many. Mom. Oh, darn. Too many fries, huh? You just can't finish your own fries. Um, <laughs> and I forgot to bring my bag of I told you so's. You got a new bag of I told you so's? Yeah, remind me to give you a great big fat bag of I told you so's when we get home, okay, Brendan? Mom, we hardly have enough money for fries, and you're, like, spending money on bags of I told you so's. Watch it, Brendan. Where were you when Kennedy was shot? It became America's question. I, myself, I was at work. <laughs> Al Steele came into my office. He said to me, Kennedy has been shot, and I saw a tear rolling down his cheek. He was crying. So, Wee. this sucks. The this is so boring. To Melissa's dad's you. gonna ask for his money back, and yeah, I've already spent it, and he hasn't even paid me yet. Uh, you know, it's very educational. You know, it's, it shows a book. You know, I, I, I can't have my name attached to something like this. I, I it. It's what Melissa wants. I bet I can make it better, Jason. I can save this puppy. <laughs> Grandpa Ned. <laughs> hey. Hey, Captain. I can take you. Hey, wake up. There. Hey, hey how are you? Okay. Oh, to the hey. left. Over to the left. Okay. Nice. Hey, uh, tell us some stories uh, about the about the war and, and stuff. Oh, yes. The World War II. <laughs> we called it WW2. What about when you used to listen to the radio all the time? What was? What, tell me about that. Oh, we used to actually listen to the radio. <laughs> tell me about that. <laughs> okay. okay, everybody. Here is the guest of honor. Everybody sing... Happy. Dad. Hey, Dad, wake up. We're, we're, we're gonna watch. We're gonna watch the video now. <gasps> oh yes. Where is that? Brendan, will you do the honors? Yeah. Um. Everyone, uh, please focus your attention to the uh, the TV. Thank you. It was 1938. We were listening to the radio. We always listened to the radio, because TV wasn't born yet. I was in, in the radio in the 1930s. It was the size of a refrigerator, and everybody loved the radio. I love you, radio. I'm a little teapot, short and stout. Turn it off, please. Brendan, is this some sort of joke? Uh, um, um, yeah, yeah. Brendan, how could you? Um, Jason, what did you do to the video, Jason? Um. Brendan, I am so... Melissa, don't even... 
You look so angry right now. This is perfect. I wish I had a camera because uh, where, are you, where, where are you going? So what did Melissa say about me? Is she, is she still mad at me? Oh, she said she was upset because you made pottery out of her grandfather. Pottery? What does that mean? Pottery, like a vase or a... Okay, are, are, you, are you sure she didn't say mockery? Mockery would make more sense, wouldn't it? Uh, yeah. Because um, you did make a mockery of her grandfather's birthday. Well, I mean, I guess. I... But she said pottery. Well, it was supposed to be funny, you know, but but poignant funny. I mean, I, I didn't really mean to make fun of the guy, but but it was so easy. First of all, life sucks, all right? Yeah. Period. Uh-huh. Done deal. You got it? Got it. There's your lesson. Okay. Go enjoy it. See you later. Wait a minute. What? There's two kinds of funny, Brendan, right? Okay. Okay, there's mean funny, which is, you know, when you make fun of someone yeah. and get laughs at their expense. You know, like stuffing that nerdy kid in the locker. What's his name? Uh, Brian? Carlo, the Italian kid. Oh, right, Carlo. With a funny accent. That's funny, too. Accents are funny. Okay, yeah, but I don't see how that's gonna help. I mean... Then there's nice funny, like maybe a little uh, light sarcasm or a clever twist or a knock-knock joke. I like those. You like those? Um... Knock-knock. Huh. Brendan, knock-knock. I'm doing a knock-knock yeah. joke. Knock-knock. Okay, knock. Right. Uh, hello? What do you mean, hello? You say, who's there, Brendan? You know yeah. a knock-knock joke? Yeah, you know, I, uh... Yeah, I say knock-knock, you say who's there. Yeah, right. Yeah, I'm, not, I'm not a big fan of... You know of, what? Of, Do it. Uh, okay. Knock-knock. Who's there? Oh, wait a minute. You say knock-knock. I don't... Knock-knock. Who's there? I don't know. I don't know who. I don't know. I hate this joke. That's not funny. It's gotta be a pun or something. You know what? Forget it. Where was I? Oh, yeah. Nice funny. You know, what you did to Melissa's grandfather was mean funny, Brendan. Okay. Putting a wig and a makeup on some old man while he's sleeping. Yeah, but did I mean... put lipstick on him? Yeah. You did? Yeah. I, That's um, good. Yeah. Did you push the call button or do the bed thing where, you know, it goes well, up I, and down? He's in pretty bad shape. We didn't, uh, no, we didn't impair his uh, health. Oh. No. That's how my grandfather died. You know, actually, uh, Coach, uh, Melissa's mad at me about the whole thing. Well, you know what? All you gotta do is make it up to her. Okay, but but how? You know. Usually, I just say I'm sorry. Yeah, well, I mean, that could work. Or you give someone money. Right. Pay them, like a gift. Or buy, buy her... A cash gift. Of course, sometimes I have to pay a fine. <laughs> <laughs> Dad? Yeah? What are you doing? <laughs> you were laughing. You're right. But it, it's funny. A 75-year-old man in drag. What's not to like? But aren't you mad at Brendan? Uh, well, he may have gone a little too far, but I don't think he was being malicious, Melissa. Boy, say that three times fast. Don't be taken in by his boyish charm. B but he is a boy. Hi, guys. It's going to take more than balloons and flowers for me to forgive you, Brendan Small. Well, b uh, both names. Hey, can I have some of that candy? No. Um, would you like a balloon? Anything? Would you... Thanks, Brendan. That's... Dad, Dad. <laughs> Jay, what, Jason? Brendan. <laughs> Help, I'm stuck in the ravine. Oh, baby. I can't get enough of this stuff. A, B, C, D, E, F, C, D. Oh, here, can I get that for you, ma'am? That's a man. Lady, man. <laughs> Let me help you with that. Oh. Whoops. Oh. Hey, Butterfingers. Brendan, let's go. It's not me! My mom did it! Brendan! That was real nice of you to help her, Mom. The elderly should be treated with respect. Yeah, but not all the time. Right? Always. Yeah, yeah, but, um, you said they were old farts. Brendan, I never said that. Yes, you did. In the car. Mom, I have it on tape. Brendan, stop taping our conversations. What, what's going on? Um, uh, I guess I did something that might, might have hurt somebody's feelings. An old person's feelings? What makes you say that? Just a guess. No, it's Melissa. Well, did you apologize? Yes, I did, in fact. Well, that's good, and? She's still mad. Uh, okay, well, you know what you could do? What? Flowers and candy. I did that. Oh. Both? Yeah. I guess I'm all out of ideas. Okay. Okay, so that's done. So we're finished talking about that. Yeah, we'll just shop now. 
Coach McGurk, I, I think I know what, what I can do to make it up to Melissa. Good for you, Brendan. I'm going to do a re reenactment of Melissa's grandfather's life. It, David, don't use your hands. This is not tennis. I, I, I can keep uh, some of the, his narration, but intercut it with new scenes. And, David, I mean, inter <clears throat> soccer, no hands. Coach, I mean, he saved a guy's life in the war, and, you know, that's what I want to show. David, I'm going to come out there and cut those off. Yeah. You think I'm kidding, David? It's just a new... Uh, What's the stupid look for? That kid's got to learn. Yeah. You don't use your hands. That's the basic rule. I know that. I know that. All right, so what are you telling me, Brendan? Well, I, I need someone big and strong to play the lead role. And uh, Lead role? Yeah. You thinking of me for the lead? I, well, yeah. Well, I'll do it, but on one condition. Okay, whatever, anything. I, <clears throat> yeah, I, I, um, I didn't hear what you said. I couldn't think of anything to say. Hmm. David! I'll cut them off! Ouch. Save this for the... For the... Think about it, your life with no hands! Coach, uh, Bloody stumps is all you're gonna have! Some of the parents are here to pick up the kids, and, uh... I was just kidding! There you go. Use your hands. It's fun. This is for fun. Thank you, Brendan. Yeah. Okay, uh, let's, let's, uh, let's try it again. Uh, Jason, Jason, I need you to be a little, a little bit more menacing. J j um, just try your line again, uh, please. Okay, um, I'm going to shoot you. Okay, uh, do, do you know, uh, any German words or phrases or... Oh, right, um, ich bin, ich bin ein Berliner. That's pretty good. You know, maybe we should just uh, try some more makeup. And, uh, uh, um, I ask not what your um, country yeah, can that's, do. Yeah, that's not so much German, Jason. I ask what yeah. you can do for your right. country in German, any in German. But, all right, well, um. No, I'm, I'm, I'm all right. It's all right. It's not a big deal. I can carry you just slipping through my fingers here. Well, you know, I'm fine. I'm a little sore. You but... know, you have a deceptive body. Thank you. I mean, yeah. <laughs> so I'm getting the wrong signals from the clothes underneath. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, it's... You know, it, you're, you're lighter than you look. You're very light. Um, I'm svelte. What, what, what does that mean? Svelte? Mm-hmm. You know that I look good in a sweater, sweater vest? Hey, how'd I do, by the way? <laughs> Ever read a book called An Actor Prepares? Uh, you know, I've only read one book in the last seven years, and uh, that was not it. Because there are special techniques that will help you get into character. I mean, do you do breathing exercises? I know how to breathe. It comes automatically. Try this. Try to breathe through your nose like this. Breathe through my nose. I've never done that before. You cover your mouth. I mean, uh, okay, everybody ready? Yep, McGurk. You guys ready? Uh, yeah. Okay. All right, and action. Okay, wait, wait one more, uh, one yeah. more question, okay, cut, Brendan, cut, before cut. we start. Yeah. What is my motivation in this scene? Yeah, you're wounded. You just uh, you want to get uh, back. Brendan, yeah? okay. I'm going to breathe through my nose during this scene. Is that all right with you? Yeah, whatever makes you comfortable, man. That sounds great. Okay, okay cut. I mean, uh, action. Action. Come, uh, come back here, German, German. I'll save you, soldier. Hey, that's some deep breathing. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> hey, who's worried? <laughs> You're Ned. <laughs> better mm -hmm. Ned than dead. <laughs> right. But better still, never Ned. <laughs> Wait a minute, hold up, hold up. Okay. What's this guy doing here? Hey. Okay, you know, cut. Okay, Eric. I, <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I, guys. Better I, I Ned, better yeah, Ned was, than dead is not. That was a, that was all very funny and a little too much nose breathing, McGurk. Um, Eric, can I talk to you for a second? Yep. Okay. Okay, you're gonna want to stick to the script. Okay, that, that, that's stay. funny, I'm that's cute, I'm and, just, uh, you know... Okay, but I'll do the lines as written. Okay, I'm gonna start you guys off again, uh, McGurk. Okay. I don't know, maybe if right, you... So you want me to pull back on the nose breathing. Right. Uh, ready, and, uh, action. Ah, oh, Brendan, I forgot my line. Okay. Jesus, say, come back here. All right, come back here. Come back here! That's great. I'll save you, soldier, don't worry. Hey, who's worried? You're, you're Ned. One of the best soldiers around. Thank you, Ned, for saving my life. You're welcome, soldier. Okay, cut. Great, perfect. That was that was great, guys. Thank you, Ned, for saving my life. Yeah, you know, Eric, uh, we cut. We're, we stopped rolling. Okay. You guys did fantastic. All right, Brendan, can we do my thing now? Yeah, you know, that's that's fine. I'll just change right here. Yeah, it's okay. Not my neighborhood. Great. Well, why don't you just tell them about yourself? Just, you know, go crazy. Just say anything? Yeah, just, just start talking, you know. Okay. All right. Hey, uh, hey, ladies. Uh, my name is John McGurk. <laughs> hmm. <clears throat> I, uh, am a professional soccer coach at the, uh, elementary school level, and I, uh, I own a nice car, though I do not currently have legal access to it. Uh, as you can see, I used to be in good shape, and, uh, in the last two years, I've 
Successfully completed four out of five rehab programs. The kind of woman I'm interested in is the one, uh, I guess, who's still watching this video. <clears throat> Cut. Okay, I'm gonna stop you right there. What? That was, uh, that was not good? We or? got it. We got this. I think you nailed it. Ah, wow. Feed me. Change me. This is my proudest moment, the birth of my granddaughter, Melissa. So, uh, uh, what did you, what did you think, Melissa? I think you just don't get it, do you, Brendan? I mean, Oh, how... whoa, <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I thought it was really good. I really liked it, Brendan. Thanks. Um, um, Dad? It, that was the biggest piece of... <laughs> Dad? Oh, um, how long was I asleep? Yay! Oh, thank you. Uh, wow. <gasps> Dad? Whoa, I feel like I've been hit by a truck. Dad? Is someone burning toast? Who keeps touching me? I can't... Huh. Dad, I gotta, I gotta hit the road here. This is not... Hey. Dad, we gotta get out of here. Who's killing this party? Everyone's leaving. Get over here. I'm not fin... Hi. How'd you like to wake up next to this? Okay, cut. No, my ideal woman is a woman who cares about the world, plus 15%. Uh, I'd, I'd like a, a you know, tall woman, uh, about my height. My ideal woman is my mother, actually, who I hate. I need a nice young woman to cut my toenails. I'm looking for a woman who will accept me for who I am and not for my money. Although I'll, g I'll give you $50. <laughs>